Hey guys, the Super Review Show here. So, the Gambit movie that we've been talking about literally since I started this YouTube channel. Uh, who said, oh, it's going to come out in 2016. And they changed it again, they changed it again. They delayed it so much. Now the producers have come out and said, Gambit movie is to eventually happen. This movie is not going to happen, guys. I I don't want to say that, but because I, I want to see a Gambit movie. I want to see Channing Tatum as this character because he's been like, I want to do what I want to do what I want to do what I want to do it. If you've delayed this since 2015, 2014, 2015, whenever, if you've delayed this in the existence of a YouTube channel, that's, to me, that's ridiculous. Because, like, why didn't you let this thing happen yet? Plus, that news that came out once, that the budget was going to be $150 million. Are you kidding me? I'm not kidding. If they make this movie... The budget had, literally should be $40 million or less because the reason everyone always asks me, people always come up to me and sometimes like, hey, why the hell is my ticket so expensive? I've seen my friends post, post stuff on, you know, on, over social media. They're like, oh, why is this IMAX ticket $18? And I'm like, look, it's not the, it's not the theater, it's the studio. The studio makes these things for God knows how much money, and they're like, oh, we're just going to put money into it. Look, they have to understand what's called budget filmmaking. Budget filmmaking is something that is very important nowadays, because a lot of people are like, I don't want to go to the movies, because it's just so expensive, I don't like the, you know, there's, there's nothing wrong with the experience you get, but the price you have to pay for it is unbelievable. Oh my God. I paid twelve dollars to see Wonder Woman. No, I paid sixteen dollars to see Wonder Woman because it was three D. The twelve was go to the th the twelve goes to the company uh, WB, and the other bit will go to the theater for three D. You know, like what the hell? Okay, because I think three D is where like the, a lot of the theaters make their money. Um, but seriously, like, why do you need to make a Star Wars? I get you'll make your money back. Marvel films D and other DC films, you'll make your money back. But for a, 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 a lesser known character like Gambit, you don't need $150 million to make a movie about a guy with a stick and cards. I'm serious. So anyways, I digress. Seriously though, I think, I know I said it won't happen. I think it can happen. Just make it soon though because everyone's losing their interest very quickly because they announced this that Channing Tatum wants to do it, and Lauren Shuler Dunn, who has been a producer of all the X-Men films, is going to produce it in 2014, they announced that. Or 2013, somewhere around there. Somewhere around then, they announced this thing. And they just said, you know, whatever. I don't know what's going to happen with this. But if well, when we do find out about it, you can find it right here on the Super View Show. So, but listen, thank you very much for watching this video. If you like what you see here, please subscribe for more. Like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter. We do a lot of posts on Facebook and Twitter nowadays. Please, so, please follow us in there. And if you like what you see here, feel free to subscribe for more. Thank you very much, guys. And for the Super View Show, J-Man, off to work here.